Ah, and the annual livability scorecard is out, and it looks like we're still on top. <laughs> surprise, surprise. But let's not get complacent here. They're saying another one and a half million more people will be living here in the next 15 years. And quite clearly, a few things need to be addressed before that happens. For one thing, who's doing anything about safety on the roads? Yesterday, I was nearly sideswiped by some numbskull in a manually driven car. <laughs> Lucky for me, my car saw it coming and the only damage was to my nerves. How long until we get these death traps off the roads? If you know someone without a driverless car, talk some sense into them. If you're still convinced you can do the job better, oh man, you need to wake up. So tell me what you think. How do we get everyone into driverless cars? Spare me. Sparing you. What does my run into work look like this morning? Good morning, Hannah. There is currently a traffic incident and routine maintenance works on your direct route. However, traffic is flowing within normal parameters. No delays anticipated. Show me. Flexible work protocols for participating employers are in place this morning for non-essential employees. No delays to peak hour traffic are anticipated. Estimated run to work? If you leave at 7.30am and drop the children at school at 7.45am, your estimated travel time to work is 40 minutes. And show me the cost comparison if I leave before peak hour. Here's the cost comparison breakdown. I'll do that tomorrow. Schedule me to go in early, leave early and do my last meeting from home by video conference. Your diary has been updated. Now, what are my public transport options today? There are three train stations located along your route with all-day parking. Will parking be available? Here are the parking spaces available at each of the stations on your route. Would you like to reserve a space? Alternatively, the local bus service has a pick-up point 200 metres from here and will take 9 minutes to the nearest station and 50 minutes to your usual stop in the city. What about carpooling options? Here are some people from your neighbourhood who are available to carpool into the city. I'll show you a breakdown of your transport options. I think I'll drive today. Your car is fully charged and will not require recharging through the day. Great! How's my schedule looking? You have a busy schedule today. Your first meeting is with the sales team at 8.30am. Your last meeting ends at 5.30pm, so you should be home at approximately 6.15pm. That's plenty of time to cook up something nice then. Send a message to Jack. Remind him to pick up some fresh veggies and basil. Message sent. Okay. Give it another 10 minutes, then wake the kids for school. <laughs>